Hi guys, welcome to New Tech Zone YouTube channel. To get notified, mind blowing latest technology news visible right in your YouTube homepage. Subscribe and click the bell button. Thank you. Hi guys, welcome to New Check Zone YouTube channel. So in this video guide, I'm going to show you if you don't have proper storage on your iPhone or iPad and still if you want to update latest iOS version, what can we do? So simply I will show you first how to update. Go to the settings and click general and click software update. Okay, so it's checking for update. We have to wait some time. It's still checking for update okay now you can find ios 13.5 which is 2.96 gb also you can find in below it says uh, this update cannot be installed because it requires at least 4.2 gb of available storage during installation so here you can find 2.96 gb uh, is the downloaded uh, file but uh, it requires minimum 4.2 gb because uh, when downloading it will hold some temporary files and it requires some more space for the installation so in this case we have to delete our photos our videos or apps and data from your iphone to update latest ios version so simply we can uh, we can update iOS version without delete any of any files. So all we have to do is connect our iPhone and sync with iTunes on our PC. So I will show you how to do that a step by step guide. So before that we will f we will find uh, what are the new feature added in this latest version. So you can find iOS 13.5 speeds up access to the passcode field on devices with Face ID when you are wearing a mask. Okay, so they have introduced a uh, face mask, face ID. Okay, it cools. Uh, also, they introduces the exposure notification API to support COVID-19 contract tracing apps from public health authorities. Okay, so that's also fine. Uh, also, they said uh, control automatic uh, prominence of video tiles on group FaceTime calls and also they have uh, fixed some bugs. Okay, guys, so let's... Uh, sync computer and my uh, mobile so uh, simply i'm using a windows computer so i have to download uh, itunes uh, i will show you how to do that with step by step okay guys so i will show you how to download itunes to your windows computer so for that you have to go to the microsoft store so i'm going to microsoft store here and if you are not uh, sign up or if you don't have a uh, microsoft store simply you can uh, sign up through this so i have already microsoft account and i'm i've logged in so once i log in into the microsoft store i'm going to uh, search itunes okay you can find here iTunes so this is the uh, software you have to download to your PC so I'm going to click get okay now you can find it's downloading iTunes so it's 214.1 MB and you can find it's downloading now so once download we have to install the file okay now you can find this product is installed so i have to click launch so click agree i can close this window now uh, so this is the itunes so i have to click agree so that's it now you can find my itunes app has downloaded and installed okay now we have to uh, sign into the iTunes so I'm going to click account and click sign in so you can find sign into the iTunes store so they ask your Apple ID and password simply you have to type your Apple 
id and the password and click sign in okay now uh, i've got a otp code to the my uh, iphone so i will show you that also okay my uh, code is 861747 okay now you can find it's accessing itunes store okay now you can find go to the itunes store if i click there i can go to the itunes store etc okay that's great now you can find uh, my account you can find here i have logged into my uh, itunes store so now i have to connect my iphone with a usb cable to my computer so now i'm going to do that okay guys now i have connected my mobile and pc with the usb cable and once i connected there will appear a pop-up message like this so i have to give trust and i have to enter my passcode in my mobile so once done okay guys now you can find there will appear a small mobile icon on your itunes app so just click that and that's it now you you have connected your mobile and pc with itunes also guys if you found any connectivity issues when you connect your mobile with the pc uh, something like that the mobile not detected or something like that i have uh, shown you how to fix that also in my another video i uh, i have mentioned the link below in my description so please don't forget to check that also okay guys now you can find there is an option check for update you have to click that once you click that if there is any update available to your phone it will show there so in this in this case my mobile has updated to the latest ios version which is 13.5 at the moment uh, when i record so it has uh, updated automatically so guys if you don't have enough storage on your iphone simply you can connect your mobile with your pc through itunes and you can download your latest ios version and update so hope you guys enjoyed my video and if you have any questions or any issues with this please don't forget to comment below in my video so always i'll try to uh, respond as soon as possible also if you like my videos please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to stay tuned more latest updates in future thank you if you like our videos please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to stay tuned more awesome latest tech videos thank you